Humans are so small compared to some animals. Next to creatures like elephants and whales, we seem minuscule. But on the other end of the spectrum, are animals a whole lot smaller than us. So small in fact, that we can hardly find them in the wild, let alone understand how they survive from day to day. While you may think that being big is better, and it does have many advantages, being small is good too. You need fewer resources to survive, can reproduce more often, and can squeeze into all sorts of hiding places to escape predators and hibernate. Here are the top 10 most smallest animals on Earth. Number 10. Pygmy Rabbit With a typical body length of 9.4 to 11.4 inches, the tiny pygmy rabbit is the smallest rabbit in the world. Adults weigh only 14 ounces. Found in North America, it is slate gray with a pinkish tinge in the winter but turns a brownish color in the summer. The tail is nearly hidden, its ears are small for a rabbit, there are whitish spots on the sides of its nostrils. Females are slightly larger than males. They generally inhabit areas with deep soil where they can burrow into tall, dense sagebrush for cover and food. Extensive, well-used runways interlay sage thickets and provide travel and escape routes from predators. The pygmy rabbit was state listed as a threatened species in Washington in 1990 because it declines in population size and distribution due to habitat loss. It was reclassified to endangered status in 1993. In March 2003, the Columbia Basin Pygmy Rabbit was federally listed as an endangered species. According to the Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife, less than 30 Columbia Basin Pygmy Rabbits were believed to remain in the wild in 2003. Did you know they are the only rabbits in the United States that dig their own burrows? Number 9. Pygmy Marmoset The Pygmy Marmoset or Dwarf Monkey is the world's smallest monkey. It is native to the rainforest canopies in Brazil, Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, and Bolivia. With a body length, not including the tail, of 5.5 to 6.3 inches, they are really tiny, and they weigh only 0.5 ounces at birth. A full-grown pygmy marmoset could fit in an adult human's hand, and it weighs about as much as a stick of butter. But there is nothing tiny about a pygmy marmoset's tail. It's longer than its body. Because they are so small, pygmy marmosets can become prey for cats, harpy eagles, hawks, and snakes. Both male and female pygmy marmosets are orange-brown. Each hair stripes of brown and black called agouti coloring. This coloration gives them good camouflage. A mane of hair covers a pygmy marmoset's ears. Most primates have flat nails on the ends of their fingers, along with opposable thumbs that allow them to grasp objects. Pygmy marmoset fingernails are like claws to help them climb up and down tree trunks. They do not have opposable thumbs. Number 8. Madame Bird's Mouse Lemur while the pygmy marmoset may be the smallest monkey, the title of smallest known primate goes to the Madame Bird's Mouse Lemur. Found in the Kirindi Media National Park in western Madagascar, they have an average body length of 3.6 inches and a weight of around 1 ounce. This species has extremely large, forward-facing eyes, which have a shiny layer behind the retina that reflects light back through the eye, dramatically improving night vision. The fur is reddish-brown on the upper side, with a darker stripe running down the midline of the back from the shoulders to the tail while, in contrast, the fur on the underparts is creamy or pale gray. The head of the species is distinctively marked with a dull white patch above the nose and cinnamon rings around the eyes. Like other mouse lemurs, Madame Bird's mouse lemur has a long tail, relatively large ears, and bare digits. Number 7. The Etruscan Shrew the Etruscan Shrew, also known as the Etruscan Pygmy Shrew, and the White-Toothed Pygmy Shrew, weighs only 0.04 to 0.1 ounces. That makes it the world's smallest mammal when measured by weight, but at 1.4 to 2 inches, it loses out to the bumblebee bat for smallest in length. Not everything about the Etruscan Shrew is small enough. Its brain is the largest in ratio to its body weight of all animals, larger even than that of a human. Etruscan Shrews live alone, except during mating periods. Their lifespan is estimated at typically around two years, but with a large uncertainty, they protect their territories by making chirping noises and signs of aggressiveness. They tend to groom themselves constantly when not eating, and are always moving when awake and not hiding. The hiding periods are short and typically last less than half an hour. Clicking sounds are heard when these shrews are moving, which sees when they rest. The shrews are more active during the night when they make long trips. During the day, they stay near the nest or in a hiding place. They reach their maximum level of activity at dawn. Number 6. The Speckled Padloper Tortoise The world's smallest turtle is the Speckled Padloper Tortoise from South Africa. Males measure 2.4 to 3.1 inches, while females, which are slightly bigger, measure up to almost 4 inches. The tiny turtles feed on small plants they forage from the rocky outcrops they call home, also using the tiny crevices as hiding places from predators. Egg laying takes place in the spring months. The clutches consist of a single large egg, but at least under human care, a female can produce up to four clutches in one season. 
Homopus signatus is a herbivore species that feeds on leaves and flowers of many different plant species. For the northern subspecies, at least 11 different feeding plant species have been identified, with Oxalis and Lazara tenella being the most popular ones. Currently, the speckled padlope tortoise is vulnerable on the endangered species list. The main threats to the species are poaching for the pet trade, habitat destruction, and traffic on nearby roads. The species does not adapt well to change in environment and captive diets, so many that are taken from their habitat die shortly after. Number 5. The Bee Hummingbird The bee hummingbird is the smallest bird and the smallest warm-blooded vertebrate. It measures 2.2 inches and weighs 0.06 ounces. Its body size is not the only impressive thing about these birds though. As at only 0.8 inches wide and 1.1 inches deep, their nests are equally tiny. The bee hummingbird's tiny wings beat 80 times a second, and during a courtship flight, they beat up to 200 times per second. The male's entire head and throat shine in fiery pinkish red, and blazing red feathers point like spikes down the sides of the breast. The female bee hummingbird is slightly larger than the male, with green upper parts and white tips to the tail feathers, and without the iridescent plumage. This bird eats up to half its body mass in food each day and consumes up to 8 times its body mass in water. Number 4. Kitty's Hognose Bat The Kitty's Hognose Bat or the Bumblebee Bat from Thailand and Burma is the smallest bat, measuring only 1.1 to 1.6 inches length and weighing only 0.5 to 0.7 ounces. It is about the same size as a bumblebee and has a distinctive pig-like snout. It lives in limestone caves along rivers, with an average of 100 individuals living in a single cave. Kitty's hognose bats emerge from their caves shortly after sunset, and again just before dawn, when they hunt for brief periods. They search for prey around the tops of teak trees and bamboo clumps gleaning insects from foliage, and seizing small flying insects from the air. Like other bats, the Kitty's hognose bat can locate prey and navigate through the trees by using echolocation. They emit ultrasonic squeaks that bounce off their surroundings, and the echoes are used to create a mental map of the area and determine the location of potential prey. Number 3. Slender Blind Snakes Slender blind snakes, or thread snakes, are thought to be the world's smallest snakes at about 4.3 inches length. Found in North and South America, Africa, and Asia, there are 87 different species of slender blind snakes. They are blind, non-venomous snakes adapted to burrowing that feed on ants and termites. Most species suck out the contents of insect bodies and discard the skin. Slender blind snakes can live in many different habitats from dry deserts and human rainforests to rocky mountainsides, but within those habitats they always seek at least slightly damp areas. These burrowing snakes spend much of their day buried under an inch or two of soil, hidden beneath stones or logs, or out of view in piles of rotting leaves or inside ant and termite hills. The species known only by its scientific name of Letotyphlops natatrix may be a swimmer. Just one individual from the species has ever been found, and it was discovered in 1931 in a swamp in Gambia. Number 2. Pedicipris Measuring only 0.3 inches length, Pedicipris is the smallest fish. Found in the peat swamp forests of Indonesia's Sumatra Island, they can survive extreme drought due, in part, to their small size. The fish, a member of the carp family, has a partially see-through body and a reduced head skeleton, which leaves the brain completely unprotected by bone. This tiny translucent fish has the appearance of larva, possesses some bizarre grasping pelvic fins, and lives in dark tea-colored waters with an acidity of pH 3, which is at least 100 times more acidic than rainwater. The previous record for smallest fish was held by an 8mm species of Indo-Pacific goby. The UK's smallest fish is the Ramin Gwilitz goby, reaching in comparison a whopping 24mm in length. Number 1. Pedifrin amaunisus The smallest frog in the world is a Pedifrin amaunisus. First discovered in New Guinea in 2009, it's a relatively new species that doesn't have a common name yet. With an average body size of just 0.3 inches, they are the smallest vertebrate and well deserving of the top spot in this list. Pedifrin amaunisus began life as, and yes, it's hard to fathom an even smaller animal. Miniaturized adults bypassing the stereotypical metamorphosis. Once mature, the adults then spend the rest of their days prowling the forest floor in hopes of snagging an invertebrate meal. And when the males of the species find themselves in the mood, they will emit a high frequency insectile call. Interestingly enough, the mating ritual of Pedifrin amaunisus ultimately led to their discovery. In an effort to identify the acoustical phenomena, the Louisiana State University professor Christopher Austin and his PhD student Eric Ribmeyer collected, quite literally, handfuls of forest leaf litter and placed the samples in plastic bags. And it was only then that the two saw the tiny amphibians hopping about the clear polyethylene, 
It's becoming more and more apparent that these incredibly small, niche-filling amphibians aren't alone. Scientists recently discovered another mini-kermit, Patifrin swiftorum, albeit larger at 8.6 millimeters in the same collection area as Patifrin amanisus. These frogs may be acting as a biotic miticide, helping to maintain balance between plant fauna and mite populations. Next time you're out on a nature walk, check the ground ahead of you. You might just be treading over an inurine hooville. So, have you ever seen any of these creatures before? What do you think? Are they cute or dangerous? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also, if you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.